Hey everybody, this is Rob Vegas and I am checking in from Melbourne, Australia and we're back with another awesome episode of Assemble the Troops and of course it is Cobra Convergence 6 so get on board and head on over to hcc788.com where you can find out about all of the awesome Cobra content creators and yeah, they're a lot better than my shows, but don't go there until you finish watching this video. We are going to go and get our bat on because we've had a bit of a bat extravaganza bonanza the last couple of days, and that's always a good time. And we are going to go check out the bat commander, which is overkill. And yeah have a heap of fun along the way we've got file card frenzy and it's gonna be great so get on board and yeah you know the drill rob vegas technology center let's head there okay so we've made it on over to the old rob vegas technology center and we've got ourselves over kill um and yeah, really cool figure. One of the talking battle commanders, as it were. Because he came with this backpack that was actually fixed to him. And yeah, when you press the buttons on there, it made you like pew pew pew. Doodle -doodle 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 -doodle. sort of noises so that was what was happening but anyway that's not what we're here about today because overkill he is the he leads the bats and he's got a few on his back there which is cool what we're here about today is file card frenzy and we've got Overkill's file card here. So let's check it out. According to this, it tells me his code name is Overkill. We've established that already. He's the bat leader. So, you guys, listen to this dude. It says Overkill began as an experimental prototype for the third generation of bats. But because of his advanced microcomputers and enhanced technical logic programs, the cost projections were too high. And they were too high for mass production. Hmm. Right. He might have been continued to gather dust on the shelf in the Cobra Research Labs. That sounds a bit like the Rob Vegas Technology Center, these labs. And if Cobra Commander hadn't decided to utilize him as a battlefield commander for the Android Troopers, it was Cobra Commander's idea to add a voice synthesizer uh, program to repeat demoralizing slogans at deafening volumes. Overkill's primary job is to operate the destructive earthquake battle vehicle. So that's how he rolls. He doesn't roll the parasite as everyone else seems to be doing lonely, but that's how Overkill rolls. He's a cool figure, and he's got an opening chest plate that reveals two 50 caliber machine guns. Now, he does have... This is really cool, and I like this. Uh, if I can... Yep, yeah, there we go. Fifty caliber, two fifty caliber machine guns. Overkill must be hardcore, because I tell you what, 
50 caliber is not fun to carry around. I might leave it there actually, folks. We're still rolling with Cobra Convergence. Do you want me to fix up <clears throat> and replace the batteries in the noise making pack? Uh, these guys were a bit of a pain, I've got to say, like having these crazy backpacks and you know, it's no secret you had to really disassemble and do a lot of busy work to just get your figure on the go. But Overkill's awesome. I like him. And he has, according to point number six, Techno Cerebral Intelligence. Um, if he's a robot... According to point three, he's got an oxygen regulator mask. So if he's a robot, why would he have that? Turbo hydraulic legs. So that means he can probably jump pretty far. Don't know. Sophisticated strength activation in arms. Psychic sensor backpack. Man. That ain't, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Did you guys have some overkill and some version 2 bats? Who have we got on the show? Shout it out loud in the comments below, and I'd love to hear your thoughts. Anyway, Cobra Conversion 6. Check out all of the amazing Cobra content creators, of course. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you, everybody.